I'm Edie Lush, and I'm here for an SAP Coffee Morning at Hub Culture within the Ice House. Really pleased to be joined now by Bonnie Glynn. She's a Vice Chairman at Hydrogen Struggles. You do a lot of work with boards and women on boards. Tell me about why that is and, and what you've noticed. Well, women on boards is a very important topic. A lot of our clients, a lot of companies around the world, there's a lot of ink on this generally because diversity is good for business. Diversity helps businesses make better decisions and still diversity in the boardroom is a natural extension of that and boards are really focused on it. Um, but what's a little bit disappointing is when we look at the numbers and I'll just talk about the US for mm -hmm. a moment. Um, we track how many new directors join Fortune 500 boards every year and for the last couple of years that's been in about 350 new directors and out of those about 29 percent have been women the last two years mm -hmm. that sounds great mm -hmm. but in reality some of those women are replacing women right and so then the number of women on boards is not projected to reach gender parity until 2040 ish in the US that's a long time it's a long time so actually some of the discussions I've been having with people say that a lot of people say you know I didn't used to be for quotas but now I am because actually if we're gonna make this happen we just need to get the numbers right. What do you think? Well, I, I'm not a fan of quotas. Mm -hmm. um, I think that serious and purposeful intent mm -hmm. and a lot of the best practices boards are embracing that will get you a diverse slate of candidates to choose from and a diverse slate to bring under your board. So I think that's the way to go. If you are a woman who wants to join a board, what are the skills that you think you need to have? Well, a couple of things. Um, I think one, one step that anybody who wants to join a board ought to take is look at your resume and really think and reflect, am I ready? Do I really want to do this? Do I have um, the general management breadth and business acumen that everybody needs to be on a board? And then go ask somebody that you respect. Have them talk to you over coffee about your resume and ask them what they think. Get, get some counsel, get some sponsors. Um, but some of the skill sets that boards are now looking for, which are interesting and unique, include having investment experience, mm -hmm. so investors. A lot of activists are now looking at boards and, um, and pushing them to add people who understand the investment, the capital market side. Mm -hmm. And so that's an area where a woman who has that skill set could be really interesting for a board. People who have experience in Asia, in emerging markets, the developing world, consumer experience, digital, there's a lot of skills that are in demand. Interesting. Thank you so much, Bonnie, for stopping by. You're welcome. The SAP Coffee Morning here in Hub Culture within the Ice House, and I'm Edie Lush.